and welcome back to my channel if you're new here hi i'm jane if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for tuning in make sure to thumbs up this video subscribe to me and the bell beside you so you get notified of my future videos i have brought you guys gist today's gist is going to be about the tonto and germena saga that has been going on on the internet for a while now so i think in the month of september Tonto the case ex Prince Popo Giri Abina Popo Giri. One of the <laughs> if you know how to pronounce this guy's name, please pronounce it because I honestly do not know how to pronounce it. They fell out and he came out, you know, talking basically talking trash about Tonto and all of that. We all saw what happened on the internet. It's not something I'm going to go into right about now. But when Toto came out to clear the air and all that, she also tagged Jemena with her full chest. She came out and said that her ex-boyfriend had a sex tape of her and of him and Jemena. And it was like shocker. We all know Jemena to be an Instagram tracker, dancer, and all that, and she is married. Now Everybody was like, wait, but Jemena is married. Does that mean that she's, you know, having an affair outside her marriage and all that? A lot of questions began to, you know, come up. And people were like, wait, did she really do it? Knowing the type of personality she gives out on Instagram, everybody was like, okay, it's possible, it's not possible. You know, still giving her the benefit of doubt to, you know, come out and talk about it and all that and we all know that Tonto is the queen of receipts for Tonto to tag you with her full chest that means that what she's saying she has facts she has proof of what she's saying Jemena came out and spoke about it and was like oh she's going to sue Tonto you know for 500 million at that point Tonto now said she was going to release the tape and then they should go to court finally an, an audio clip surfaced where Popo Giri was talking to a lady we don't know who the lady was talking to the lady about him and Jemena's encounter their sex life and you know certain things that she told him about her marriage and also saying that Jemena was the one who married her husband that one was a shocker to everyone that you know she's the one catering for her family so the man doesn't have a choice and people began to think that knowing how the Nigerian culture is is it that Jemena's husband is actually really cool with you know her being an Instagram tracker dancer his family you know we all know how this thing work honestly I also felt that maybe he is also aware and he knows what is going on you know with the nature of her job because let's be very honest in Lagos especially we have people who are in open marriages you know they know what they are doing they know that their wife is outside they know that their husband is outside just for the purpose of bread having to get out for the kids and all that um, maybe the husband is actually aware of what is happening or maybe not it could be that she's actually innocent of the accusations it could also be that it's true but we all know that Pogiri has been called out as a blackmailer and someone who does a lot of things with all these celebrity ladies on a low so finally his cover has been blown open you know after his encounter with Tonto and she came out saying so many things about him about how he's a blackmailer and how he has had so many things to do with you know ladies in the industry people have been asking Jemena did you do it or did you not do it and she has not come out to say anything again after the audio clip leaked you know she, her brother came out and started talking about how she lost a pregnancy because of the whole situation the trauma she has been through and all that and people were also accusing her that oh you know that you were pregnant but yet you were still trekking online what were you expecting so there's just been so much with this gist with this particular case on instagram because one thing about instagram is once you bring your matter to instagram it's automatically everybody's business because if you had it in private sorted out your shit in private nobody will come out calling you you know out on instagram but we finally came out to you know apologize to jemena's husband you know that he's sorry i don't know what he's sorry exactly for is it because the audio clip came out for is it because he strapped his wife or is it because you know or the things he said in the audio clip kind of you know bringing down his fellow man that he's not been able to like cater for his family the lady is the one catering for the family she's the one you know that married him and all that so i'm just like what is he apologizing for what is his main reason for apologizing because that didn't make sense to me if you wanted to make things right 
you know where to you wouldn't bring all that for people to have opinion about it so honestly i feel bad for the man at the same time it could also be that he's fully aware of what is happening you know with his wife and he has not come out to say anything which i don't think he should even come out to say anything because he's not the celebrity his wife is the one in our faces she should be the one to come out and clear the air as of this morning news came out that Tonto has you know pressed charges and has like, arrested her ex-boyfriend this is a bold step because this man has been you know talking around internet he's been opening his mouth anyhow he talks with no caution he says things the way he feels he should have said it and even when it's so dirty there are certain things that we don't need to know he comes out talking about it and i'm just like I'm just, I just feel bad for Tonto because I honestly don't know how she got with this guy. I don't know how she met this guy. Like, it's just funny. Like, people of her personality or of her status should not be mingling with people like this that open their mouth like Gotha. Like, ooh, his mouth smells. I'm sorry. But you once liked this person. You once loved this person. Except she was just a target to you. And we all know what Tonto has been through. Like, you know, with her ex-husband and then now this... I mean at this point i think she should just give love a break and just focus on her child her business you know her career that's all i would just say but who am i like you know to advise her i feel like she knows what's best for her let's also appreciate how tonto has shown growth and handled this situation so far for jemena i feel like it's time for her to come out and clear the air you know and normally this type of things when they happen if you're innocent all you need to do is just make a statement you know or say okay let's go to court or something but she hasn't come out to actually give a serious statement a statement to clear the air that okay i didn't do this thing she hasn't really come out to say it even if she doesn't want to say it she has management of course her management can come out and you know stand in for her and all that she hasn't made any effort in any way to clear the air so people actually think maybe she did it her comment section has been blowing up and this is where it is right now but if anything comes up within the week me trust me to bring it for you so subscribe to my channel thumbs up this video share this video and leave a comment share your thoughts what you think and i'll see you guys in my next one bye guys